You know what? You've been hiding this secret for way too long. So I'm here to help you out. I'm here to help you build up the courage to get your scary ass out that closet. <laughs> What's up, good people? How y'all doing out there? Me, I'm sick. Y'all can probably tell because I sound nasally, stuffed up, stuffed up, stopped up. Which one is it? Is it stuffed or stopped? Whichever one it is, that's what I am. But the show must go on, so we still gonna knock out this video. I might knock out like two or three so yeah, it's gonna be like three videos in a row. Y'all gonna be like, damn, what the hell wrong with him? This dude been sick for like three weeks. Nah, I was sick for how many ever days and I just knocked out a bunch of videos and spread them out over the weeks. So that's what that's gonna be. I ain't up in here sick as a dog for like no three weeks straight. I'm just saying. But anyway, why y'all why are some of you all closet collectors? That's a question I'm asking. What are you ashamed of? Are you uh are you afraid of what people are going to think? And no, nah, I'm 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 truly asking for those who hide what they do. I'm genuinely curious. So you know, or, or, or maybe you used to be in the closet with your hobby, your collection, right? Why, why, why did you, why, why were you in the closet? So that's, that's for everybody. That's for the people who are still in there, who are incognito with it, and for the people who used to be, but are not anymore. Why were you there? Or why are you there for those who are no longer there? Why were you there? What made you say, you know what? I'm just going to out myself. <laughs> Drop y'all responses in the comment. I'm, I'm curious to read some of those, right? But I'm saying like, what are you hiding it for? What are you afraid of? What people are going to think? Who don't pay your bills? who don't uh, cut your checks, who not responsible for you, who, you know, for the most part, you're probably, you probably rarely see, unless it's like immediate family, then, you know, that's different. But I'm just talking about like strangers, outside family members, whoever, right? People that don't, that are not your immediate family. Like, what are you afraid? Or what they're going to think. Uh, what you worried about that for? Like I don't, I don't worry about that. Like you not paying my bills. You not, you not taking care of me. You not, you not paying me. I don't care what anybody thinks. It's, it's not their life. So, like, why are you even worried about that? So. I, I, I'm generally curious about the in the closet collectors because honestly this is not the craziest thing collecting action figures that is that you could be collecting like I looked up online some of the stuff people collect is beyond me like I'm like why like you, you like somebody looking at you like why wow, I'm looking at these people like what in the world are y'all thinking like really? And even outside the strange stuff that people collect, and I'm, I'm I'm probably gonna do a video on like strange things that people collect. It's like a whole list of stuff online. Outside of the strange stuff, it's other stuff you could be doing, like alcohol, drugs, gambling. All kind of just crazy stuff. People buying uh, paintings of just blotches that somebody just took the paint 
It just went ah, and voila, you got a pain, and somebody gonna spend like two million dollars on that. That's crazy to me, and I'm in the art, and I'm looking at that like, really? I could have did that. My homeboy sent me. He sent me something. What it? What was it? I can't remember what it was. It was like, like somebody took a piece of tape and taped. Damn, what was it? I can't remember what it was, but it was something like so simple. And the thing sold for like $2 million. It was like a bottle taped to a piece of cardboard. It was something crazy like that. I can't remember what it is exactly, but I'm gonna put it in this video so y'all can see it. And I'm gonna put how much it sold for. And y'all gonna be looking like, that's crazy. But yeah, like my thing is, what you ashamed of? What you, what you, why you in the closet? Why you hiding it? it it's, collecting action figures is not the craziest thing you could be doing in the world. Hell, I'm proud of my stuff. My stuff is, it's like a museum. And like I said in the other video, I would say like 95% of the people who even see this stuff is like blown away. And then I talk about my stuff out in the open, like people having conversations and they get to talk about something and, and it just come up. I just talk about it. I don't care. Or if they if I'm talking about what I did over the weekend, they be like, man, what you do over the weekend? I was like, man, I went to the shop, which I actually did this weekend. I went to the shop and grabbed so 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 so. Oh, word, what's what is that? Bust out the pictures, bam. They be like, oh shoot. Most people, when they see the stuff, they are like, like, like blowed away. Where was I at? I was somewhere this week. Let me see. No, I was at. I was at the post office, right? I was at the post office asking the postal worker about a, about a uh, figure that I had shipped out. And I was asking him because the dude who bought it from me was acting real shady. So I was asking him, is there a way that I can stop the shipment and have it sent back to me? Because I don't trust the person that I'm sending it to to not be on something shady. And he was saying, yeah, you can do that. It's called interception, blah, 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 right? And he was asking, what am I shipping? And I told him, he was like, I told him Hot Toys. And he's like, oh, I never heard of Hot Toys before. What is that? Man, it's my opportunity to shine. I bust out the phone, start scrolling through my pictures, showed him some pictures, showed him some videos on my channel. The dude was like, oh, shoot, like that looks real. He, he, blown away. But that's how I roll. That's, that's what I do all the time. If it come up, I'm letting people know about it. And 95% of the time, most people was like blown away and amazed at how this stuff looks. Now, depending on the, the 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 level of action figures that you collect, that's not a guaranteed reaction. Like if you show somebody Marvel Legends, it's not a knock on Marvel Legends collectors. I'm just saying you might get a different response just because Marvel Legends don't look like hot toys. So I can't guarantee that's gonna be the response you get, but 95% of the responses I get for my six scale figures and my like masterpiece transformers or three zero, the high end stuff is always positive. So, and again, that's not a knock on my Marvel Legends collectors, but let's just be honest. There's a different level to this stuff. And some things is gonna be viewed as toys and some things is gonna be, be viewed as collectibles. And the stuff that's usually viewed as toys is generally toys, which Marvel Legends are toys. And I got some Marvel Legends over there, so y'all don't come for me. I got a couple right there. And I got some behind me, cause I use them for photography and doing like pose and stuff. But I don't display them. But that's a different conversation, whole nother topic some, for another time. Listen, even with the cheap stuff, if people ain't feeling it, so what? If that's your thing, that's your thing. I mean, it is what it is. Whether it's the low end stuff or the high end stuff, if it's your thing, it's your thing. And who gives a damn what people think? Get your ass out that closet. But anyway, my point is when I'm showing it, when I'm outside, I'm always showing off my stuff. If it comes up, I ain't just out randomly, just, you know, doing drive by, you know, show us to people like running up on somebody like, bam, look what I do. I ain't doing that. I'm just saying if the stuff come up, I ain't sitting there trying to hide it in the closet. 
That's all I'm saying. Uh, like I said, for me, in another video, it's like collecting art. So I'm not even tripping. I'm always showing off my art pieces. And the funny thing about my hobby and what I do, and what most of you who watching this channel do, the stuff that I get, I can sell it and get, if not all, some of my money back. A lot of this other stuff that people be doing, they can't get no money back. Once that money is gone, it's gone. I can take all this stuff and sell it and get a good chunk of money back. So who's really the fool? <laughs> but that's it, man. That's all I got. Just a video about being in the closet with this stuff. It's like, why? But like I said, y'all drop y'all comments. And uh, that's going to do it for me. I'm going to get up out of here. I'm going to try to do another video if I feel like it. Otherwise, I'm going to go lay down. But I'll holler at y'all at the next video. I'm out.